Okay, let's talk about the uh, gastric balloon. Uh, the gastric balloon is one method to lose weight. Um, it is a procedure that is performed under short procedure under general anesthesia and we use a gastroscopy, a flexible tube with a light to go inside the stomach to position the balloon. Uh, it's an outpatient procedure. Um, it is um, with very low rate of complications. The procedure is best done in patients who have a body mass index between 27 and 35. It gives about a five to six points drop of body mass index, and this may translate to 20 to 50 pound weight loss depending on the body mass index. Um, the procedure, um, uh, uh, after uh, general anesthesia, we will introduce the folded balloon into the stomach and we'll put saline or salt water with a mixture of uh, methylene blue. It's a dye and uh, this indicates that if there is a defect in the balloon and we have a leakage, the blue dye will be absorbed by the intestine and may give a uh, uh, green urine. So if there's a green urine, we have to remove the balloon right away because a deflated balloon can cause an obstruction in the small intestine. And this may require surgery to take it out. So uh, after six months, uh, we will go back, do a second procedure, uh, the same thing under general anesthesia, introduce a gastroscope, puncture the balloon and aspirate its content and grasp the balloon and remove it. And then the patient can go back to home. In the first three or four days of the insertion of the balloon, we may see symptoms like nausea, vomiting, difficulty with eating solids. There's a diet to follow. Uh, we have to give a medicine to decrease the acidity so it doesn't eat up the wall of the balloon. And it's best in the first three, four days not to have any work and being quiet at home. Uh, the balloon uh, uh, is contraindicated in patients who have a hiatal hernia. That's a hernia between the esophagus and the stomach. And this can be detected by a swallow x-ray preoperatively. The other contraindication is previous surgery. So patients who had sleeve gastrectomy cannot have a gastric balloon at the present time um, or any other types of surgery in, in this uh, area. Um, so it is a, uh, it covers the need of patients who are not candidate for surgery or afraid of surgery and uh, would be uh, too large to get a medicine to get good results, medicine and, and diet. We will sometimes combine the balloon with medicine towards the end or after balloon removal, we will give a medicine to prevent weight regain to obtain the best long-term result of a gastric balloon.